Hi everyone, Jason again. I'm back with another workout, but today it's going to be a different kind of challenge because this week is Mental Health Week, um, and I've been thinking about mental health quite a lot, and I've been representing the Fleur team from the Education Authority, who are fantastic at what they do. Um, so, just in relation to exercise and mental health, I've, I've wrote a wee message down, and I've broke down mental into different um, letters and different words. So, M is for movement. Everyone's built to move, so you should be moving all the time. And it doesn't have to be strenuous, it can be enjoyable, it can be rolling about the floor, but just get up and move. E, E is for endorphins. So when we exercise, we release endorphins into our head and it automatically makes us feel good. So if you're feeling stressed, if you're feeling down, if you're feeling anxious, these little chemicals in our brain are automatically released after we exercise and they make us feel good and they give us that get up and go for the rest of the day. N, N is to never give up. Life isn't always easy. And exercise isn't always easy, but if you never give up, you start to see results. T, always make time to exercise. No matter how busy your day is, five, ten minutes, even just doing the workout Wednesdays, it only takes a couple of minutes to follow along. So you should make time for exercise because it invests in you in your future. A, always do your best. You don't have to be the strongest or the fittest. Just challenge yourself to be better than you were yesterday. So if you've done ten press-ups last week, do eleven next week. And L, L is always listen to your body. Sometimes we get tired and it's about going, am I stressed, am I anxious, could I do exercise? Or do I need to rest, do I need to take easy? Do I need to take it easy? Okay, so without further ado, I have uh, 10 exercises today. Um, we're gonna follow, follow them as best as we can. I've actually hurt my legs, so I'm gonna do them as best as I can as well, but with no excuses, okay? So um, just follow along um, and do your best, okay? So, our first exercise, this is my notes of, of, of what we're going to do, is press ups, okay? So again, you can just hold yourself to the ground, or you could do the diamond, okay? So we're going to go for 10 reps of each this time, not 20, 10, let's go, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, Seven, eight, nine, ten. Next exercise. Mountain climbers, okay? Press up position again. Ten, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Squats, okay, again, just go down as far as you can go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, keep going, nine, ten, straight into our split squats, okay, so one, two, only step as far as you can go. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wrestlers kick throughs, okay? Hands. Lift your opposite hand and your opposite leg. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. Remember, you can't just set your foot on the ground. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, we're going to do mountain climbers again, but this time is a wee bit different. So we're going to bring our opposite leg to our opposite arm. So across the way, across the way. Okay, let's go. One, two, try and touch your elbow. Three, if you can't, it's fine. Four, if you only get to here, it's fine. Five, six, seven, eight, 
nine. Okay, new exercise, hand walkouts, standing up straight, bend down, touch your toes, you need to bend your knees, bend your knees, walk your hands out, as far as you can go, and walk yourself back up again, okay, so, one, two, Three. If you can only go this far, that's fine. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Last one. Make it a good one. Ten, well done. Three more to go. So, prison squat. Hand on the top of your head. And just squat down as low as you can go. So, you can go here, here, or right down. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. Well done. Okay, so lie on your back. Hands are going to go across. Place on the floor. Bring your feet to a 90 degree angle. Use your hands to press down into the floor. And lift your backside off the floor. So one, two, Three, four, if you want to make it harder, do it one leg. Five, six, seven, eight, but two legs is fine. Nine, go as high as you can go. Ten. Okay. So, we've done nine reps of 10 exercises which means you've done 90 reps so now the last challenge is and this is going to be the the hardest one to do do it with me 10 more and that's it okay so remember never give up keep going we'll do it together so squats but they're called tempo squats so we're going to go really really slow let's go down really really slow One, good. Keep going. The slower you go, the better. Two. Go as low as you can go. Three. I'll show you from the side. Four. The temptation is to go really, really fast, but don't. Six, well done. Seven. Let's do the last three, come on. Eight, well done. Two more. Two more. Nine. Last one, really, really slow, really, really strict. Hold it, hold it, up slowly, up slowly, up slowly. Fight it, fight it, well done. Well done everyone, that was really, really good. That was a different challenge this week, but sometimes when mental health can throw different things at us, um, and we, we have to face those challenges so hopefully you got through that even if you only got five reps in three reps in maybe two exercises doesn't matter you done it which is the most important thing okay so remember stay fit stay healthy stay connected and remember look after your mental health and exercise is the perfect way to help you do that okay so look after yourselves